I'm sorry the camera quality is kind of weird right now but I come from the MUN and it's called the IIMUN Mumbai okay so what happened is like one of it's one of the biggest MUNs in the world I think because there are uh, thousands of people in case you guys don't know what an MUN is it's more the United Nations where you act as delegates of other nations in the UN organs and uh, yeah so I'm Netherlands I'm representing Netherlands in UNO DC which deals with drug, drugs and everything so our agenda is um, legalization of marijuana so let me get back okay so yesterday they gave us food okay and it was from this company which gives box food okay like, like they give meal plants and shit yeah so I'm worried now that nobody's gonna come and I'm gonna be the only person or at least one of the few people who's gonna come here and I hope that's not the case you know I hope that's not the case okay guys in case you still didn't understand what was happening basically the food was delivered from box seat and they had promised that they will send it from different locations for the different um, different locations of their kitchens of box seat to the different locations of the IIMON because it was really big it was not in just like one place it was in different places so they had promised that but they instead took it to freaking another location took it to the literally corner of the city and took it to another corner of the city and when asked why did they do so and they were like in the morning it was fine and our lunch break was at 1.30 so in the morning he is speaking of 9.30 the box air guy and we were just like what okay so there were a lot of, there were a lot of people who puked and it was disgusting i must say even though i didn't feel like puking that much but i was feeling squeamish just because of all of the puke that i saw and i was i don't know i have a strong belly and i'm proud of it i was the author of the final resolution for unodc so it would pretty much suck if i didn't come for the actual presentation of the final paper so yeah so that happened but I'm fine and a lot of people that I know are fine thankfully a lot of people didn't eat the food because they felt it, it was really sour and it did feel wrong to eat but I didn't want to completely waste it so I ate like a little of it and then I threw it away thankfully I ate a little and not all of it because people who ate all of it had to go to the hospital anyway but the volunteers were really nice and they actually themselves were puking spitting it all out wiping their faces going out and helping us and as soon as they came to know they wanted to stop us from having it although in my unit it didn't really happen but I guess other people did say so and we signed it as students because these guys actually asked to those box seat people for a compensation or at least an apology for what they have done and they felt very deeply sorry as they say at box seat but uh, they were like what was five kids gonna do to our big company so these guys came up with a petition to file against these box seat people and uh, they wanted us the students at IIMUN to sign the petition because then they have so many students against that one company so yeah I signed for it a lot of people didn't get it which is kind of surprising but a lot of people from my area at least from my venue did and um, it said uh, it basically needed our name our signature and our phone number and they are actually doing this compensation for those people who could not attend the IMN earlier but even we can attend who attended first and later do they can also come for the second IIMN that is a compensation for those who mm -hmm. didn't come earlier and it is going to be held in a few months and uh, I don't think I'll go for it but my friend is very insistent on going for it because he really likes MUNs <laughs> and this was his first one and he really enjoyed it and I really enjoyed it too because I this was the first month actually this is my second month but this was the first one I actually spoken and it felt nice okay uh, and our chair was kind of weird but our vice chair was good and um, what else yeah so we went for the opening actually this is skip to first ever I am an um, event that I attended which was the inauguration ceremony for um, the IMN which was at uh, NSCI Stadium so at first it was good you know we had uh, Terence Lewis who's a very famous dancer I think he comes in a lot of TV shows too 
uh, yeah, he was there and uh, he actually gave his inspiration for all the artists out there and all that. That the main guy who, who actually founded Ayaman talked about how India doesn't have a permanent seat at the Security Council and that's why we had to go for a march after the whole thing. I actually, um, the entire thing was good until I came to the part where Leslie Lewis came in the ending which was kind of very ob absurd. If it ended at that Rishabh Shah, I think his name is Rishabh Shah. If it ended at this guy's um, speech which was really inspirational since he said that we don't really care about things until it actually affects us since in the 26 in yeah in the 26 11 attacks in mumbai his uh, friend's father passed away so yeah he, that really hurt him and it is tragic to hear about all of that you know and uh, yeah so basically the march was to get a seat for india which is a permanent and uh, we can get a veto power then so that we can actually deal with the crisis at hand with power so yeah that was good but then after that it just started going around somewhere else or the other and then Leslie Lewis came which was really weird because he was singing an Arijit Singh song why I don't know in case you don't know who uh, Leslie Lewis is he's more of a rock kind of artist here but he sang Arijit Singh just because he's trending right now and he failed and there was this other chick who was singing on a track and it was very evident so she was singing and there was a track and they were going like that it was horrible excuse my nails sorry it happens to all of us okay yeah so the track and her were clashing like this I'm gonna say that it was a disaster to listen to myself but I feel like I get it you know because in my last cover in case you didn't watch it you can I'll link it down below yeah so my last cover was a dangerous woman I feel like when I'm talking to you guys when I'm live actually I sound way better than the recording that I did but I still not feel like taking it down because you know you know there might be this one song which in which I sound way better than re real life so you know gotta give it a chance so yeah so basically that was the thing it was really fun and there were, the volunteers were really sweet and um, the thing that they were compensating and making a new I am UN completely like a replica of the other one just so that those kids who couldn't attend can attend this one is really good and in my opinion actually I don't feel like it was I am UN's fault as such for all of the food but I felt like they should have taken even more stricter actions towards the food before serving it. Obviously, they can't go and open up every box before giving them. But they could have done something else to make sure that this mishap doesn't happen, you know. Because, um, yeah, before transporting, they could probably check it. I think they did, but it still didn't work out because it was a different carton than the ones that it was distributed to amongst the students which is like freaking bullshit but yeah shit like that happens so yeah but it's not I entirely I am in my opinion I want to conclude it's not entirely I am your god fault um oh I went all Hindi there <laughs> it's not entirely I am your fault but it is also a little just a little just just to take a little bit more precautions I really appreciate whatever they're doing, but just a little. But I feel like it's box it fall to a completely new level because they really should have not done all of the things that they did and should have kept to their promise and delivered from the locations which were near the ones that are the venues for I Am Mun. Since there were like three different menus, the same kitchen to be used for every delivery of like the MUN with one of the most largest uh, participants is pretty stupid so yeah but it's just my opinion so let me know you guys what do you think about it um, yeah it's been circulating in media for quite some time and I just wanted to put my opinion on it so yeah <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy talking to me I'm really tired right now I really am. <laughs> like I'm, 
um, I'm, you must have noticed it by now because I'm like moving a lot right now but I'm really sleepy and I don't know why just I am today and I feel really weird it's, but I feel weird every day right <laughs> it's hard so I'm gonna go eat some Chinese and I'm gonna sleep and uh, yeah so you know forget Netflix and chill it's Chinese and chill hashtag that was my hashtag in case you didn't see that alright there we go alright thank you so much you guys and I love you. Thank you so much for watching my videos. And this is just my opinion, so you gotta keep it with, keep that in mind. It's just my opinion, and I love you guys so much. And I will see you soon. I will see you next week. Stay slaying. Bye.